station, you will see some of our experimental air turbine designs equipped with passive blade control. The demonstrated runs were done in a 130mm tube of moderate air flows, generated by a vacuum cleaner fan combination and a recap at low speed. The whole setup with a leaf fan attached is shown here. Bidirectional flows were a major challenge in turbine. Its 12 blades are flexible, with head portions fixed to spokes transferring the torque to the shaft. The tail parts are interconnected by a floating ring that is actuated back and forth by the direct dynamic forces of the bidirectional airflow. Through this displacement, the blades bend and adapt their camber and pitch in a beneficial way. As a result, the angle of attack is kept approximately constant over a large range of flow. Flashlight photography reveals the effect of the airflow on the blades. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a My solidity rotors develop reasonable torques of airflows with high on influence, like a centrifugal or radial fan found in the vacuum Playing around with solidity, we cut a 100% eight blades rotor down to a 50% four blades rotor. Due to a much lower pressure drop, the airflow had to be increased to move to the same torque. While the airflow of the vacuum cleaner is limited to around 40 litres per second, the leaf vac easily does up to 250 litres and exhausts the rotor's adaptation range already to the lowest power On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me five golden rings to find out. Since the leaf vac is equipped with an impeller fan that does up to 250 millibar, just like a vacuum cleaner, the result is obvious. It developed a tremendous torque at high rotational speeds, and its shaft couldn't be decelerated in the front of the hands. However, when filming this scene, the leaf vac ran at lower speed to avoid runaway due to air dissipation. Seven swans are singing, six geese are laying, five golden rings, four calling birds, three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the eighth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me eight maids are milking, seven swans are swimming, six geese are laying, five golden rings. Some additional streamlined air against the camera and a partridge in a pear tree. Without any outer control. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. On the second day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. Turtle doves and a partridge in a pear tree. On the third day of Christmas, my true love gave to me three French hens, two turtle doves, and a partridge in a pear tree. On the fourth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me 